what's up you guys welcome back or if you are new to my channel then welcome I'm Maggie and yeah if you guys enjoy this video then please give it a big thumbs up and if you're new to my channel then please subscribe and yeah if you guys want to learn how I did this makeup then keep on watching first of all I'm grabbing the Urban Decay primer potion I'm just applying that all over my eyelids to make the colors stand out a lot more and to make the eyeshadows stay a lot longer. Then I'm going in with the Hula bronzing powder and I'm applying that all over my crease. Don't worry if it's messy, that's the point. It doesn't have to be sharp or anything like that. Just keep on blending the color until you think it looks good. Then I'm going in with the Naked Basics by Urban Decay and I'm grabbing the shade Faint and I'm just applying that over my crease just to define it even more just to darken up the crease and just to clarify if you guys didn't notice my voice does sound weird and that is because I'm sick so I'm sorry if that bothers you hopefully it doesn't but oh well I'm sorry about that then I'm grabbing this purple shimmery shade I don't know where it is from, where I got it, but yeah, I'm applying that all over my crease again. Just the thing about this makeup look is that you have to blend, blend all the colors together, but try to not overpower the purple over the brown. Then I'm grabbing an eyeshadow by L'Oreal, and this is in Purple Obsession 005, and I'm just applying that a little bit lower of where I just applied the other purple shade and just yeah keep on blending those two colors together if you feel like you need more purple pur purple if you feel like you need more purple then keep on adding purple because I know that it might look like you don't have enough purple keep on adding purple if you want Then I'm grabbing an Urban Decay eyeshadow in the shade Half Baked and I'm applying that all over my lid. And if you want to make the eyeshadow stand out a lot more, to make the gold stand out a lot more like I did, on the middle of my lid I applied it with a wet brush. After applying the gold eyeshadow, make sure that you're blending all the colors together just to make sure that there aren't any harsh lines. So moving on, I'm grabbing a L'Oreal liquid liner and I'm just trying to wing out my eyeliner. You guys know I'm terrible at this, so I'm just trying to make it as best as I possibly can and yeah. Then I'm moving on to foundation. I'm using these two foundations. Well, it's a foundation and a BB cream. And I'm just mixing those two together and I'm just applying those two on my face. And then to make the makeup look more flawless, I just went in with my beauty blender to blend it all in again. Then to highlight and to conceal, I went in with a MAC concealer and I just made triangles under my eyes. I applied some on the middle of my brows, down the bridge of my nose and on top of my lips to make them look bigger. And then I blended that all in with a Real Technique brush. If you guys are wondering what shades of foundation and just concealer I'm using, all of that information is going to be down below if you guys want to check that out. Then I'm just applying a pressed powder by L'Oreal to just set in the foundation and to make it last throughout the day. Then I went in with a spoolie on my brows to just brush them out and to make them look good before I start um, grooming them out and I went in with the browsing and I'm in the shade medium if you guys are wondering so first I always applied the gel and then I go on top of the gel with the powder
And then to set my brows, I go in with a clear mascara and then I just brush it through my brows and those are my brows. Then I'm grabbing the Naked Basics again and I'm grabbing the shade Foxy and I'm just applying that under my brow to highlight. It's amazing, I love that shade for under my brows. And then I went with that shimmery shade from the Naked Basics and I'm just highlighting my inner corner. Then I'm going back with the Hula Bronzing Powder and I'm just applying that under my waterline. And then I'm going back to the Naked Basics and I'm grabbing the, again the shade Faint and I'm applying that on top of the Hula. And then I'm going back to the Purple Eyeshadow by L'Oreal and I'm just applying it all over my waterline. Well, not all over my waterline, but under my waterline. You guys, you guys understand. Then I'm grabbing a pencil liner by L'Oreal and I'm just lining my waterline. I know it looks very weird, I hate filming this part but bear with me guys. And then I'm just curling my eyelashes and I'm going in, I changed my duo you guys. I went in with the false lash wings by L'Oreal and this mascara is amazing, I love it. It separates your lashes like no other mascara. I don't know, if you guys have a holy grail mascara, please leave it in the comments down below because I really, I'm in the hunt for a good mascara. And then I'm applying on my bottom lashes and then, obviously I have to use this mascara, so I'm going on top of that with the Their Real by Benefit. Then to bronze up my face, I'm going in with an Avon bronzing powder and I'm just applying that under my cheekbones and as near as my hairline as possible to make it look like natural, you know? Just not any harsh lines. To avoid harsh lines, we don't want any harsh lines. Then to contour, I'm going in with a The Body Shop bronzing powder and I'm just slightly applying that on top of where I just applied my bronzing powder just to carve out my cheekbones. Then I'm going in with a MAC blush and oh my god, this is so pigmented you guys. I was so scared to apply it because last time that I used it, I just looked like a tomato. Then I'm going in with a Reverend highlighter and I'm just applying that on top of my cheeks and near my eyes, like on top of my brows. Then to finish the entire makeup look, the last product, I'm using a YSL makeup makeup i'm using a ysl lipstick and i don't know sadly i don't know the shade of this lipstick because it was a, a sample that was given to me but it's super pretty so i'm showing it to you guys so maybe if you guys own it you can tell me in the comments down below what shade is it because i totally love it and that is the finished makeup look if you guys liked it if you guys enjoyed it which hopefully you guys did. Please give it a big thumbs up and subscribe if you guys aren't already. I will see you guys in my next video. Bye lovelies!